Heavy rain and once-in-a-generation floods has caused the collapse of six houses in Germany's western state of Rhineland-Palatinate, leaving several people missing and many stranded on rooftops. Earlier reports by broadcaster SWR said around 30 people were missing and about 25 more homes were at risk of collapse in the district of Schud Bei Adenau, in the hilly Eiffel region, citing police. We currently have an unclear number of people on roofs who need to be rescued, a spokesperson for the Koblenz police told Reuters. There are many places where fire brigades and rescue workers have been deployed. We do not yet have a very precise picture because rescue measures are continuing, the spokesperson added. Rail, road and river transport has been disrupted in the country's most populous region. Advertisement The German Weather Service issued an extreme weather warning on Wednesday for parts of three western states, while Hagen, a city of 180,000, declared a state of emergency after the Volm River burst its banks. Put my lean out here.
kommt ein Auto. Oh wei. So, und da kommt die Nette runter. Und so sieht jetzt mittlerweile der Makana aus. Wir stehen hier nur relativ trocken. Das ist Land unter, ich komme nicht zum Bahnhof, gar nicht. Du kommst ja nicht über die Straße drüber. Siehst du ja. Der läuft komplett ab da hinten. Da geht gar nichts mehr. Also was habe ich noch nie erlebt. Die schwimmen. Weil die Bank schwimmt frei gut. Weil hier ein Sandwall ist. Da hinten sind die Mülltonnen unterwegs. Ja, so sieht's aus bei uns im Moment. Oh, I go.
Heavy rain has caused chaos in some parts of Germany and neighboring Switzerland and storms are not forecast to let up soon. At least one person is missing, presumed dead, after being swept away in a flood. Heavy rainfall fell across parts of Germany continued into Wednesday, causing flooding and damage to buildings and other property. The states of Saxony, Thuringia, North Rhine, Westphalia, NRW, and the southern state of Bavaria were hardest hit by the extreme weather. In the town of Jostat, in Saxony, emergency services were searching for a man who was swept away in a flash flood. In the Bavarian city of Hof, around 1,000 firefighters and 140 rescue workers were deployed to incidents caused by flooding. Regional authorities declared a disaster situation to better coordinate the relief operations. The measure was lifted again on Wednesday morning. While the extreme weather has eased off, some schools and daycare centers remained closed in the area. In Dusseldorf, the capital of Germany's most populous state of NRW, firefighters were called out around 330 times by Wednesday morning to attend to flooding incidents, including in basements and underground garages. In the city of Hagen, also in NRW, over 100 liters of rain per square meter fell in the past 12 hours. A retirement home was evacuated due to inflowing water. One person who was buried was injured and several drivers were rescued from their cars. The rainfall has swelled the River Rhine, which flows through NRW, triggering restrictions to shipping in some areas. In the southern state of Baden, Württemberg, an 81 year old man is reported to have fallen into the flooded Jagst River, which is in flood after heavy rainfall on Monday night. He's swimming. On the night of Wednesday, July 14, after heavy rain, the fire department of the German city of Hagen received hundreds of emergency calls. The amount of precipitation exceeded 100 liters per square meter. The situation did not improve over the morning. People are desperate, said a fire brigade spokesman. Streets are flooded, cars are floating on water, several buildings have collapsed, and a local nursing home has been evacuated. In some parts of the city, the electricity was cut off. It is known that torrential rains and floods that hit western Germany have already claimed the lives of 42 people, more than 70 were missing, and thousands were evacuated. 